Like I said, I try not to use the words like have to or need or must win. I almost think those kind of get you tight. And I talked to the guys last night, but they live it too. It ain't just me talking. It's, it's the idea that let's, you know what we have to do? We just have to let her rip. We have to let her rip. We have to not worry about what we're supposed to do, have to do, expectations, all this. And let's just go let her rip. And that's what they did, all facets. Because we know, you know, what we're capable of. And I just, I just think this showed a lot of character. You know, you reveal a lot of character when you go through time that's a little, you know, yeah. a little down. And, you know, you got everyone in Spokane wanting to walk off a ledge with the first big sky <laughs> loss. And then, but our, our, our kids, you know, they reveal a lot of character and how they responded to it. And they do a better job than I've seen coaches in terms of their resiliency and I, I love seeing that today out there on the field. Uh, their run defense every bit as good as you you were saying all week long and, and so you had to kind of rely on the passing game again. Jordan West played a, a pretty good game. What did you think of his performance today? Yeah, I thought he played really good. I mean, there'll be a few things he go back, but I thought he also, he, he was well-timed with his aggression. Yeah. You know, and, and, and part of that is, you know, I felt like I did a better job putting him in those situations than maybe I did a week ago. So, but we still had to grind out some runs too. Mm -hmm. You can't just sit there and chuck it all day against anyone and get into November. So. So I thought our O-line still did a great job against a great run defense, still finding ways to churn some runs. But when those when those plays were there to be made outside, we were a lot better than you know than we were a week ago in terms of that. Their 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 team throws a wild card at you. They they burn a red shirt on a quarterback. You have no idea what to expect. Your defense comes out here only gives up three points. You got to be happy with that. Yeah, we saw him in warmups and we kind of heard rumors. <laughs> so we're in there scrambling after warmups to see what he did in high school, how many yards he ran for. I mean, we knew he was an athlete based on he ran for like 800 yards as a senior you know so but that's all you know sometimes that's all you can go after but really that part didn't matter the defense was going to swarm and going to play their tails off just like they've been we've been growing we've been growing as a team and we definitely see it growing as a defense that has a lot of young guys but talented guys mixed in with some veterans who are bringing those young guys along you know and, and it's just a fun mix so and you're able to see that today it's one of those games we got to get a lot of guys in the game I mean, probably almost everybody they dressed got in the game if not everybody how, how big is that for you guys to be able to reward guys for their hard work and get some playing time in the game? It's huge. They deserve it, you know, and when you get in these type of games and they are able to do that, you know, it's, it, it's a, it, it is. It's huge because they work so hard all year round. And some of them, you know, it's rare opportunities when they get in. So when you can earn the right to kind of empty your bench, it's just it's just fun to see those guys go in. It's a team coming off a, 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 a one-sided win going into just another game, I guess. Montana coming to town next week. It's a game everybody looks forward to every year. We still don't know what's going to happen with Vernon, but, you know, I think Jordan's playing pretty well right now, right? It's, either way, you're good to go. Yeah, we're going to, you know, whoever's, it doesn't matter if it's a running back, a corner, a quarterback, an O-lineman, a D -D -D -D, it doesn't matter. Whoever, if someone's down, then it's, you know, the next guys are going to step up, and we've been doing that all year, even even regardless of just the Vernon piece, that's the one they get focused on, but there have been a lot of other guys who have been out, and then other guys come back, and, and we just rally around, you know, whoever's in there, so, you know, yes, yeah, so I'm going to be excited, you know, with the day Vernon comes back, but at the same time, I'm just excited for our team to, you know, have another great opportunity next week. All right, well, we appreciate your time, and if no one's ever told you before, you're <laughs> <laughs>